Lord God, we come before you as friends and family of these two, and uh, we pray a special blessing upon them. God, I ask that you would be glorified tonight, and that you would bless this wedding, and that you would bless their marriage forever. Lord, we love you, and we want to honor you tonight with this. Amen. Proverbs 18, 22 says, He who finds a wife finds a good thing. Joey, you have found a good thing. This, this woman that you're married right here, I have seen her grown into a woman with passion for the Lord and strong conviction. A woman who has clothed herself in strength and dignity. Kylie, James 1, 17 says, Every good and perfect gift comes from the Father above. And you found a good and perfect gift here. Dear Jesus, thank you so much for this sweet, sweet, special day. I am so thankful, Lord, for all that you have done to bring this day to fruition, Jesus. I just wanted to pray that we will have such a blessed day, Lord, and that your will is being fulfilled as we um, will have this union together today, Lord. I just wanted to thank you for um, bringing Joey into my life, Lord, for loving me like you do, and let's have a great day in Jesus' precious name. Amen. See you Earlman. I cannot believe that this day is finally here. As I make these vows to you and as I'm looking into your eyes, I want you to know how much I unconditionally love you. Kylie, you are my light in darkness, my best friend, the love of my life. I love you not just because of what you mean to me, but because of what you mean to the world the most kind, gentle-hearted, and spontaneous person in the world. You are my rock, my best friend, my love, my leader, my joy, my adventure, my dream come true, my world, my everything. We have gone through so many life changes together and have persevered through many obstacles and I would not want anyone else by my side. Your love has no limits whether we spend the day watching movies or end up flying to another country for once-in-a-lifetime memories. There's never a dull moment with you. Besides the gift of salvation, you're the most precious gift God has given me. I know that along with new joys, I face new responsibilities that I cannot fulfill in my own strength, but by God's grace and power working within me. You're the love of my life, and you make me happier than I could ever imagine, and more love than I ever thought possible. I love you, Kylie Marie. I promise to show you every day that I know exactly how lucky I am to have you in my life. And above all else, I promise each day that I will love you more fiercely than yesterday. Wow. Based off those vows, you're going to have the best wife in the world. Because Joey and Kylie have consented to be married, and by the exchanging of vows and giving and receiving of rings, believing that God is pleased and His will is now being accomplished, it now gives me great pleasure by the authority of God and the laws of the state of Texas to now pronounce you husband and wife. Joey, you may kiss your bride.
Kylie, the day is finally here. I know. Isn't it surreal? Like, we're, we're here, you're getting married. Take a mental screenshot of everything. <laughs> Texas turned out to be a little like winning the lottery for Joey. I, for one, will attest to the new person I encountered on my first visit. Cowboy boots and hats have replaced helmets and skates. Boats and fishing rods have replaced the rinks and hockey sticks. And it appears we have a new head coach in the game. Joey, when you walked into Kylie's life, it was pretty immediate that I knew you were going to be the one. I saw the way that you looked at her, the way that you treated her. I knew that was going to be it. Everyone, please raise a glass to this beautiful bride and groom. We love you all, and let's have a good night, everyone. Better dance on that dance floor. I better see everyone.